All right, guys, so today we're going to be talking about Young Miami. So, Young Miami went on Twitter and went crazy on academics and a bunch of people giving her crit their critiques on the situation between her and Diddy. She said, I'm nobody's side bitch. Let's just make that clear and it's good money. I don't come second to no bitch. She also said, academics, my name ain't dick, so keep it out your mouth. You the type of nigga my uncle doing life sentence for for bitch-ass nigga. She said, you sit your fat, scary ass in the house all day talking online. Come outside, police-ass booty boy. <laughs> she also said, bitches be like, I can never... I I can I can bitch and that's the difference. Diddy won't even look half of y'all bitches way. Majority of y'all praying upon a star, a fallen star, bitch, please. Then she ends everything I was saying. I'm not mad. I'm trending next. Now I just want to say this. To be honest, Carisha, I love Young Miami, and you know, like I said in my last video, what she choose to do with this situation is what she wants to do with her in that situation. But you can't like get, you know, going off on Twitter about like, oh y'all can't this that and the third. If we being honest, Diddy wasn't even technically looked at in that type of way ever since Cassie left his ass. If we being honest, you know what I mean? You're the only reason why people kind of like look at Diddy as in a good light. Because ever since then, he was not looked at a good light if it was not for you. So I get it, you know. You have to. Under, you also have to understand people have opinions, and you're a public figure, and I know that it can be annoying as fuck being that you're a public figure. But it's like you're in a situation that a lot of these women just. You know, they're, they're in that type of situation. They just don't publicly say they're in that situation or just don't know that they're in that situation. Or they just, you know, they just... People have opinions and you cannot be mad. I feel like that's the, like that's what I, all I that it really is. You cannot get mad and go boasting off on Twitter. Now, academics, academics, you know, academics... Yeah, go off on academics. I don't give a fuck what nobody say. Academics takes shit a little bit too far. But I feel like going off on of bitches about your situation is just stupid. You know what I'm saying? It's just stupid. Like, you're a public figure. You're in a situation ship that you publicly like and that you say, one minute you say you're dead and you did you send another thing and then you got this woman that's pregnant that came out of the blue. And at first, we're going to talk about it. You're a trending topic. You're Carisha. You're, you're Miami. You're the topic. So that's all it is. I love Carisha. I understand the frustration of of being, like, talked about all day about something that people would be people would do. You know, but like I said, Diddy and Young Miami benefit off of each other. You know, I feel like the only reason why Young Miami is truly with him is because she probably likes him and it's, you know, she probably fucked him. But I feel like Young Miami is trying to become a billionaire low key. Y'all have to really watch what this lady is doing. I feel like she's slick using Diddy just so she can get what she want. And that's nothing wrong with that. Young, Diddy has done it to a bunch of people to get what he want. So if Young Miami is doing that, you know, she's a city girl, hey, by all means. And that's my opinion on the situation. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.